I was so nervous for some reason. Please don't show how much I sweat without showing how much they put me through. I thought I was gonna get here and like lift the bar one time. That's not what happened whatsoever. I mean, we're extremely strong. We're, we're animals, right? Strong chicken legs. <laughs> <laughs> Really quickly, what do you guys do like on the day to day to stay healthy and work out? I'm really into supplements and like I like spirulina, blue green algae, but I just go to 24 hour fitness. I don't do anything crazy. I am a PhD student and a professional sprinter. I'm like, go over there. No. <laughs> um, but there's like a big difference I feel like between like lifting for sprinting and then it sounds like a lot of y'all like lift for lifting. Is and lifting I feel like, like a regular different. part of your training? Yeah, we lift like two to three days a week. That counts. Yeah. <laughs> More than me. I have a cerebral palsy, yeah, so I run for the U.S. Paralympics. For so long, I shied away from things that I thought would be too hard because of my disability, but then the more that I got into running and lifting, the more I was like, no, like I can do these things like just as well as everyone else. What about you? I've been lifting for about 10 years, but I would say between like 2012 and 2016, that's when I was like really intense about it. But nowadays, like I could work out six days a week. Sometimes I don't work out at all. Well. Because of your history, I feel like you I know. should yeah, go. So, like, yeah. we can just, like, <laughs> we can shift down this way. Thanks. I'll just go down here. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Please, <laughs> please. Okay, I feel like I should at least be no. After here. the sprinter. Uh, no, <laughs> and you uh, lift. Uh, I, come, uh, come up here. You know what? I'm like, <laughs> Okay, hold on. Wait, wait, hold yeah. on. You're an EMT. Yeah, I feel like I don't you know. know. Well, EMT you have to be able to, like, lift. Yeah, yeah. that's right. That's right. Okay. Well, we do have the fire department, so we always say lift with your fire department, not your backs. Um, but oh. <laughs> I will say, yeah, I think I, I think I check. I think I do 10,000 steps per shift. I work 911 in Albuquerque. We're a pretty busy system, and uh, I have had to pick up people off the ground where I was like, it's just me and my partner. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. look, 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 guys, guys, listen. Okay, there's adrenaline involved, you know. But like right now, I'm here and sweaty, so I don't really think it's going to be the same also scenario. Also sweaty. We haven't even started lifting yet. I've do you want to kind of want to like? Give a little description on how we started lifting. I'll go first. So I, I don't lift whatsoever. <laughs> um, I actually I do exercise though. I, I do boxing and oh, I go. Oh, 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 oh. Oh. <laughs> but that has nothing to do with weight training, which is why I feel like I should be more this way. Like, okay, okay. Still strong though. I, I feel know. like you have that like explosiveness. I know. Yeah. Yeah. Like, like, a little pump here and there. <laughs> I got into lifting um, when I started doing track. Uh, I randomly started in two of the weirdest events, pole vault and javelin in high school. And the uh, guy who coached both those events, he had this program called like Six Week Freak, where between the like- That's what I asked you. Right? I was like, <laughs> damn, we are It's like a Magnus song. But it was like a six week program where we focused on like three main Olympic lifts. And I was like, oh, this is so cool. Like it's easy to set like very specific goals and like you can watch yourself achieve them. And I think also there's a really good community of like non-binary and like femme people who lift who are really focused on like reclaiming like not just body positivity but just like body neutrality and being like this is my body and it does things for me and that's awesome. Yeah. I got into lifting after I came back home from college. All my friends were working out at the gym at Crunch. It's like oh I'm gonna do that because I have all this time now and then I still continue to lift because my job requires it and also because I feel more empowered and independent. So I started lifting well I was uh, always grew up athletic I played basketball and sports but when I got into college I kind of started going down a dark path and I was starting to have like an eating disorder to the point where I was eating like one meal a day and then, sorry, <laughs> I don't wanna get like emotional. Okay. Um, it got to the point where I was like even like bulimic, but weightlifting has, sorry, I'm no, like nervous. Take a deep breath, yeah, yeah, yeah. it's very emotional to talk about this. Yeah, cause I don't like talk about this with anybody, but weightlifting has given me a positive outlet for me to take care of my body in a positive way. Cause it's hard being a girl and just every aspect of your life is just predicated on how you look. Yeah. Like pretty privilege is a thing. So yeah. that's, yeah, yeah sorry. I'm like really thank nervous you. saying that. Thank you. thank you guys for being so supportive. <laughs> I didn't think I would get that nervous talking about it, but how about you guys? So I was one of those people that walked the mile in PE. <laughs> yes. But it wasn't until the summer of my senior year of high school where a friend of mine who was really getting into lifting brought a group of us over to the gym. And I remember I was having trouble 
with just the bar, and just the bar is 45 pounds. Now, here I am 10 years later, powerlifting has opened so many doors for me, where now I'm learning, you know, snowboarding, Muay Thai, and uh, backpacking. I'm like, I'm scared. No. <laughs> yeah, like, come this way. Like, I know, this is cool. No, 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 no. You gotta go over here. I just like learning new things. Like I'm, I yeah. doesn't mean I'm good at and it. And your though. body's able to do it because yeah, you're strong. Yeah, yeah. 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 Uh, for me, it's kind of you know a, more of a sad start. My ex-boyfriend beat me to death uh, when I was uh, 20. I was like 20, 21. I, I think I just like blocked it out. I was like 20. Instead of like running away from things that scare me, like you know getting hit and all that stuff, and like you know being cornered by men, it was like if anyone's gonna hit me, it's gonna be on my own terms, right? Yeah. And so it kind of went from that. Started lifting. I was like, I'm actually kind of strong. You're a bad <laughs> dude. You're a bad. No. Dude. No. You're a bad. You should be. I think, I think I have one question, which would be, how, just like raise your hand, like how many of you have lifted competitively? Just you, okay. Uh, oh, and you. I feel like you gotta go All this right, way. all right. But that means you gotta, you gotta move too. Yeah. I yeah. Think, yeah. Well, that yeah. way, yeah. Uh, <laughs> no. no, I think, I think this. Uh, mm, I don't know, you're like a PhD student who like outruns like I, other humans. Professional. <laughs> no, but yes. we, we've been tapering, so I've not lifted in, a, in like a month, so. I'm gonna, I just, I All really, right. I really right. believe. <laughs> okay. You've worked your way back down here. <laughs> I, I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> yeah, let's okay. lock it in. This is our. Have you done a deadlift before? Um, not seriously. Not seriously? Okay. Okay. Hold on. Can you go closer? All right. So yeah, I would just go hips width apart just to start first. Okay. Okay. It's gonna be a little harder because the bar is not raised by the weight. So. Yeah. Hey, there you go. Uh, keep the weight in your heels too. Yeah. Okay. okay. That was pretty good. There you go. Yeah. 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 There. Oh. Yeah. Okay. 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 I'll see you. I've been pretending this entire time. <laughs> yeah. Do you want to do 185? Are you okay Let's with that? Let's do it. I'm. I'm like this. She's like, Let's do it. No, guys. I'm game. She's got a secret. I feel like. Okay. We got a hyper up properly yeah. then. Oh my God. Let's go, girl. I'm hazing the newbies. Let's go. I believe it. Remember, drag it up. Push through your feet. Yeah, yeah there you go. go. Uh, let's go. Stay tight. There you, you got go. This. You got this. You got it. You got it. Yes! Yeah! 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 I love it. Yeah! You didn't even win. I was pretty good. Yeah, you did pretty freaking good. I thought I was right, going to lift right. once, and that was going to be it. Do you have enough chocolate? Go closer, 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 closer. Yeah. Let's this. go. Perfect. Yeah, right. let's go. Plant those feet. You got it. Bree, I'm so proud of her. Like, I can't believe she never lifted before. I hope this like inspires her to like try it out. You know, it was invigorating, I will say, and I think I would try it again. I'm not crying, there's sweat in my eyes. <laughs> yeah, you got it. Let's go, let's go. Big breath. Come on, you got it. You got it. That's a lot of weight. I don't even know if I can do that, honestly. I think I'd have to either, I'm gonna try this, but if not, I'm gonna have to take five off. Okay. What are you listening to? Death metal. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> go right here, big breath. Right, let's big, go. Breath. big breath. You got it, you got it, you got it. I'm gonna go a little lighter. I'm gonna go a little lighter. So All right, light weight. I hope so. Just seeing those weights on, just seeing them rack it, I'm just like, okay, here we go. This. Like we all hella strong. Yes. <laughs> like been Ooh, just yeah. Right, yeah. Let's do it. Yeah. Now she talking Let's like go. she want me. Yeah.
feel like you needed silence in that one. Yeah. Yeah. I think it's really cool to see people who are smaller than me lift a lot more than me, and I feel like that's a misconception a lot of people might have. It's time. Got this. Let's go. Lock in. Stay tight. Would this be a PR for you, or? Uh, yes. Ooh. Oh, dang. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Now, let's go. You got it. Go, 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 go. Oh, so good. Oh, I felt that. Do you want to try again or? I think I'm good. You got this. You got this. You got this. All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh. Okay, you got it. You got it. I'm like internally screaming. You got it. You got you. Make noise, everybody. I'll like look at the plates and be like, oh gosh, like that looks intimidating. But with everyone cheering, it kind of drowns that out. Let's go. Being able to see how when a community comes together to encourage one another, it does produce really good results. That's 315 right there. That's crazy. That was crazy. It was a slow and graceful fall. Yeah. It was yeah. like, Whoop. That looked good though. That looked amazing. Thank you, thank you. Now I'll get it next time and I'll get it cleaner. What was your personal record? Uh, today? It was 295. Um, it was wow. 295 before. It was a struggle of a 295. Wow. That was so, so I was very surprised to see when I did 295 today, it just ripped Ooh. off the floor. I feel like everyone should lift. It's such a great foundation. You're gonna feel good about yourself. You're gonna meet great people at the gym. And also it's nice to see what your body's capable of doing. Yeah, weightlifting rocks. <laughs> Do you have any final thoughts? Um, I'm really excited to take a shower. Overall, it was a great group of women and a great experience. People underestimate women probably a lot more than they should, and women are stronger and more capable than a lot of people think.